Welcome back to 504 Road Trips. We're going to do something different today. Uh, I don't normally do product reviews, uh, but I've got something here that I was so impressed by that uh, I decided to do this little experiment here. Uh, this cup here, which is made by Corksicle, uh, it's the first cup that I've ever had like this that will actually keep coffee warm. Uh, this thing can be used for hot or cold and I got two, one to drink iced tea in at home and one to drink coffee in at the office and it's a pretty good sized cup. I guess it holds about 20 ounces of coffee but since I've been using this thing um, I make a pot of coffee in the morning I don't even turn the burner on I fill this cup up to the top and I drink it all day long. Uh, I don't have to turn the burner on on the coffee maker anymore because I never have to refill the cup and this is about the limit of what I'm going to drink over the course of an eight hour day. And uh, that's good because I had some problems with coming in in the morning and finding that I left the coffee pot on all night and the stink of burnt coffee throughout the office. Uh, but it's a relatively simple design. The top has this little sliding thing here so you can open and close it. And I don't, actually it's a little hard to open and close, but I don't even close it during the day and it still keeps the coffee hot. So what we're going to do is we're going to fill this thing up with hot water straight out of the coffee pot. And we're going to take a time lapse and, and we're going to put a probe thermometer in there. And we're going to see how long it stays hot. So stay tuned. So we're going to start here by just running water through the coffee maker. I'm not actually going to use any coffee because that would be a waste of coffee but this will get the water up to the temperature that coffee normally is when I pour it into the cup So that's our water. Now let's get a temperature reading on it. So we're going to pour the hot water into the cup. Put the cap on it. And we're going to drop a thermometer in there and see how hot it gets. It is well the thermometer only goes up to 160 and it's wrapped around I'm gonna guess that's probably 170 180 degrees so now we just wait and see how long it takes for that temperature to drop to say below 100 degrees and we'll time it. So we're at the six hour mark and this thing is down to 120 degrees and I'm not going to go any further than that uh, just because the battery in this camera is not going to last much longer. Uh, but 120 degrees is still not exactly cold. 
I mean, it's not piping hot coffee anymore, but... Uh, that's still pretty hot. You could take a bath in that water. It's, it's so hot. And I mean, it wouldn't be bad for coffee. But it's not ice cold like normal coffee cups are. You know, if you just leave them out for half an hour or so. So... That's the cork sickle is what this is called and like I said earlier I don't normally do product endorsements but this has really impressed me and I had to say something about it uh, look them up on the web this wasn't something we ordered online either this was just something that was on a display at a pharmacy and uh, sippy girl picked up a couple of them and uh, even kitty cat seems to like it so thanks for watching if you like this video give us a thumbs up comment below subscribe follow us on social media share this video and join us for our next 504 road trip